Hello guys, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and good night to whoever's watching right now. It is April 9th, 1.35 in the morning. Uh, I, wasn't, I wasn't supposed to work today. Uh, today, supposedly my second day off, but uh, I had a cover co-worker today. Uh, he told me he wanted uh, another Monday off, so like a good co-worker I was, I took his Monday uh, would I be doing that next week? No, I would not. I'm getting tired of these uh, six-day work weeks only because I'm not able to fully, um, I wouldn't say appreciate the day off, but I wouldn't be able to fully, you know, do everything I to do to start the week right. You know, I'm always pressuring myself to do it quicker on a Sunday and putting everything all off on Sunday, um, where that day I'm usually just at church and I'm with my church friends and, uh, Sometimes I'm not able to do any of that just because I need to go to the store. I need to go wash clothes. I need to, to go do, you know, various things. So next week I am not going to be taking some, no one's Monday um, work shift. It, it, it was a six hour work shift today, but today I needed to go take my car into um, doing some maintenance. That took like two hours. I, since we left the gym around like four o'clock at night yesterday, you know, I fell asleep. I woke up around one o'clock in the morning. Yes, that's my fault. But I need to get my hour, my my eight hours in, bro. No matter what, just because I am getting sore a lot quicker, and it's taking a little bit more to recover, and that sucks. Just because I am pushing myself a lot, and uh, you know, I, I need those eight hours to recover. Just because I want to, you know, rest well so I could, you know, look better and my muscle could slowly recover and you know gain all that. Um, like I wouldn't say stretch marks, but you know, in order to grow, you do need to recover. That's that's the that's the gist of it. Uh, so today was a solar eclipse as well. Uh, I wasn't able to see it. I think I made. I I slept it. I slept throughout the whole thing. But for some reason, I was able to see. I think okay when I woke up, it was around like twelve forty. That's when I woke up. I went outside to go look at it. The, the black moon was still there. It wasn't obviously at the right, the best moment, but I went outside and I, I went to see it and it was pretty cool. You know, I'm not going to lie. My eyes were, I, I didn't have the glasses, you know, I don't know where to buy them. So, um, so I call it, um, sorry, that was my friend that just hit, just texting me right now. But I went to go outside and I went to go see the solar eclipse and it was cool. My eyes were definitely blinded for a quick second, but they were good. My dad was seeing it through the TV, but not knowing he could go see it outside. He didn't have the black glasses as well. So pretty much he had a trash bag and he just put it on top of the sun and <laughs> and he was looking through it through a black trash can. That's what his Mexican dads do. And it was kind of funny. But uh, yeah, um, I am outside of the gym right now. Uh, before going inside, I was checking to see if I still have access today because yesterday you guys saw my chest and triceps they I didn't have, I didn't have access to go in. So I checked today as soon as I got here, I got access. So I'm really happy that we could go inside and we could go get this lift in. Again, I'm still looking at my surroundings just because uh, I am the only one here in the parking lot and at the gym so I'm definitely gonna take my uh awareness a little bit higher today but um yeah so it's gonna be good great day today we got back up biceps uh we're, obviously we got some abs we're always gonna be doing abs so today we're gonna do some weighted crunches get out get that out the way and then we're gonna go start right away with our um back so we might we're most likely gonna do some um lap pull downs uh we're most likely gonna start with lap pull downs we're gonna get that out the way and then from that pull downs so we're gonna throw in some t-bar rows for the wide for the wider back upper back and then definitely gonna throw some um some close grip curls for that middle of the back so we can get that big boy thicker because we need a big back activities we need that big back you know i know right now there's like a meme saying um there's a meme that is going out there like oh bro got a big back like i think that's like shouldn't be a compliment but to be honest, for me, it's a compliment. So I like when people call me, yo, this is the guy doing big back activities. Hell yeah, I am. I love that shit. So um, those are the three movements. And then we're going to end it with some isolateral, um, like, pull pull downs with the rope. Or not the rope. With the 
with the handle, obviously the side. And then from there, uh, we're probably going to end up with some pull-ups, uh, three sets of failure. I'm pretty sure I'm not, at the end of the back workout, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be able to even pick up myself up. But, you know, we're going to try our best to even pick ourselves up for three sets. It might be a few reps, but it is what it is. We're, I'd rather do it at the end of the workout because I want to see how much, even though my back is already exploded, I want to see if I'm able to even do a pull-up at the very end of my workout. So I think that will be great to see if I can or not. And then we're going to end it with some some um, rope. Not rope, but with some some cable curls. I think that's what he call Cable curls. Uh, that's going to be great. And we're probably not. Uh, I, I want to throw some hammer curls too, but I look, you just want to do one bicep workout just because... My arms are really sore from yesterday's chest workout. Uh, I did three sets of 225 uh, for bench for five reps, which is amazing to me. I never thought I would be even seeing that number, but it's amazing. That's incredible. I really am pushing myself, and it got to the point where my tricep was more was usually more sore than average. Uh, I never had my tricep that sore at all, but yeah, yesterday's workout was pretty, pretty crazy uh that is the update for today work was pretty chill we only had like three flights uh i brought all my food to work luckily so we're back on schedule today we did wake up a bit more just because of yesterday's meals i woke up today at 231.7 pounds which is i hit my 230 goal but i know that's not just that 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 weight is only gonna be for like a day or two just because i know i am gonna get lower like my weight fluctuates so i'm pretty sure i'm gonna go back down to um 228 or 227 in a few days so we're good um but yeah guys that's a little update for me let's go inside and let's get this back uh, workout in but before we do let's pray a little bit uh well for today for you know yesterday because i didn't pray i did pray for um for my food in the, in the morning i believe but i didn't pray for you know the whole day i really want to end the day or even start the day with the prayer uh, but for you guys, you guys are seeing this is technically my after shift. So this is like my uh, my morning for you guys, just because uh, uh, this is pretty much middle of my day, you know. So uh, let's hit this prayer, guys. Hello, Lord. I'm talking to you. This is Carlos Olide. And um, just want to say thank you for everything you've done. Thank you for letting me wake up today. Thank you for letting, still having, um, letting me have my mom, dad, brother, and sister. I really appreciate you. I appreciate them every single day that they're here. I uh, don't take that for granted at all. Um, thank you for the food, Lord. Thank you for letting me go to work safe. And thank you for letting me be at work and stay safe the whole time. I really appreciate that. Uh, and letting my family stay safe as well. I um, hope you're hearing me, God. Um You've been treating me and not only me, but my family well um, since I was born. You've been helping me out. You've been showing me the ways, even though I felt like I was alone and, and you know, doing everything um, by myself. I know you were there with me. I just need to open my eyes and clearly see you just because I haven't been able to do that. I've been always telling myself that it's me that I've been doing everything. But I know you're by my side and I truly want to know and appreciate you for that. And uh, thank you for everything you've done. And I love you. Uh, bless this workout. And uh, keep me safe for today. And, you know, keep going, guys. Love you. Amen. <sighs> Let's get to the workout, guys. Let's go get this workout. Just uh, finished with our, uh, with our abs. So now we're going to start with our first movement. We're doing four movements, like I told you guys. This is going to be one of four. So we're gonna be doing some lap pull downs. We got the, it, this grip is not the widest, which I like. I don't want a super wide grip. I like one that's like around medium size. So here it's pretty good. And it's a neutral grip, which I like too. So we're gonna be doing here, uh, I'll say like one or two warm ups, and then three actual sets. And uh, from there, that's it. We're not gonna go too, nothing too crazy. So my first warm up is gonna be 100 pounds. We're gonna feel the weight here. Since we're pretty tall, we can't go all the way up. Oh yeah, we can. No, no, we can't like it. So, oh, we're gonna feel it. We're gonna keep it like right here. Come back up. 
Good warm up. I like that. Our next warm up is going to be 140 pounds, and uh, we're going to be pushing some good weight here. Uh, here, we're not doing too much. <sighs> Great set there. So our next set, we're gonna go straight to 180. So it's a little bit more than half uh, half the stack, which we like. That's what we like to see. We're gonna grow. And again, we're gonna slow down the movement <clears throat> when we coming out, and then when we come in, a quick explosiveness. And then we're gonna try to keep it down there for a quick second and then push up eight to 10, maybe 12 if we can. And this is where we're gonna start the actual moments and actual sets, three sets here. Goal is anywhere from eight to 12 reps will be nice. This is where we're gonna be pushing our, our limits here. I haven't done 180 in a while. So let's do this. great say I like that damn we are actually getting pretty strong 180 is it's pretty hard controlling it like the way I did so I like that well let's rest up for like a good minute minute and a half let's get that second set it was working that last set man I'm really proud of myself I'm liking the way it looks like the set you know the reps I like it <sighs> Let's hit that second set, baby. Whew. That's good. <laughs> I like that. I like the way it's moving. We got one more, baby. One more of those. Holy cow. Whew. 
Uh, that was my third set and my last set right here at 180. This is gonna be the first actual set here. Whew. Let's get it. <sighs> Great set, I like that. <sighs> two more, two more, baby. Two more. <sighs> Second set here. My thumb is bleeding. I accidentally picked at it and now it's bleeding a lot. Great. This is why you don't have to pick your thumb. Like the sides of it, broski, because damn, it's just bleeding arc a lot. All right, forget about it. Let's hit this next set. Second set here. Set one more to go. Whew. Let's get it. Come on, Carlos. good on to the next workout so yeah, we're gonna go to 140 and then go heavier each time well 140 and then we're probably gonna go one heavier we're not gonna go too crazy heavy right here let's get it damn it's, i'm bleeding so bad here on my thumb it's actually getting pretty insane I forget it, let's get it. To 160 and probably keep it there for the next two sets but look look at my thumb guys i'm not playing around look how disgusting that looks <sighs> damn that sucks we bumped the weight the weight up to 160 now so it's gonna be a little bit more challenging now Yeah. <sighs> 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 
That was good. Great set. We got one more, baby. One more. All right, guys. Let's do our last set here. Back is already getting super tight. So uh, let's, let's finish off strong. Great set. Let's move some, let's move on to some isolaterals. You'll see right now. Uh, 10 to 12. That was, a, that was one set there, and we gotta do three, so that was great. My lats are really on fire. I don't know if we're gonna be able to do pull-ups after this, but we shall see. I'm starting to break a sweat. Great set. We got one more to go, baby. One more. Let's finish strong. It's gonna be the last set. It's gonna be the last set right here, guys. Let's finish strong.
Ah, that's it. I can't go anymore. I gotta fart. Oh, I farted. I farted so bad. Does it smell? We're in the clear. It don't smell. Good shit. Let's go do just three sets of pull-ups to fully end our back work out there. Uh, and easier to failure. So whenever I stop, I stop. All right, boys. Three sets of pull-ups here to finish off our back workout. Let's get it. This is going to be the first set of three. Uh, holy cow. Yeah, my back is fried. Oh, let's see. Let's see how many we got. maybe five but like two of them were half reps so maybe three that was good <laughs> that was more than i expected for sure let's do um instead of doing overhead or wide grip let's do um the last two on the let's see if that makes a difference Hell no. Nah. <laughs> oh shit, I'm just dead overall, guys. Uh, I'm not gonna give up until we finish these three sets. Uh, I feel like such a pussy. Oh, we got one more set, man. Holy cow. Let's go. Bless it. That's it. <laughs> Let's go do some biceps, man. Just take the pump cover up, guys. Because we got cardio after this. So we don't want to get too, get this too, you know, sweaty. So pump cover's off. And let's finish our workout with some biceps. We're gonna be doing here four sets. Well, three, let, yeah, let's do four sets. Four sets here, and we're just gonna be doing some bicep curls here. So let's do three sets. And these are technically called dragger, or yeah, dragger curls, because we're not gonna go here, this way. We're not doing this. What we're gonna be doing, instead of doing this, we're gonna go here, here, backwards. So for the bicep peak, guys. That's what I heard from Seabum. So we're doing it that way. And we're gonna do it again, four sets here, 110 pounds, so like 55 pounds each side. Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> 
<sighs> Whew, that was a great set. <sighs> I feel like my biceps are already pumped off of just that, that one set, you know? You know what sucks about my genetics? My arms do not grow as quickly as any other my, any other of my body parts. Chest is growing immensely. I like. Back is growing really nice. Everything's my legs are finally catching up after so long of me training them. They're finally catching up a little bit to my body. But these arms, bro, they do not want to catch up to anything on my body. We just gotta keep training them every single day. Well, not every single day. You know, just keep training every single day and eventually everything can catch up. On my week, on my days off, I try to give it a little more attention. You know, my weaknesses, definitely my calves, arms, forearms, definitely more attention because they don't grow as fast as my chest, shoulders back. So yeah, like my face is beginning some gains too. Like look at how puffy this is, bro. So puff. <sighs> Great set, great set. Two more little bad boys, two more. Great third set. We got one more little bad boys and we're done. That's it. That was it for today's workout, boys. Uh, I'll meet you in the cardio room. All right, guys. It is 3.35 in the morning. We're here in the cardio room. We're going to get these 20 minutes on out the way and uh, get the fuck out of here because I'm sleepy and I'm tired and I still need to shower and go to sleep. So, uh, yeah. Let's get this out the way, and I'll see you guys at the house for our last meal, which is a protein shake. It is 4.24 in the morning. Well, 4.25. Now we're going to make our last meal, which is a protein shake. Okay, we're using peanut butter cookie for our shake.
shower. Call it a night, guys. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys. Take care. God bless. Go work out. Go lose weight. It's 2024, guys. Start putting that energy on yourself, guys. Come on. It's not good to be fat. Especially in 2024. Start working yourself slower.